provide the actual pickup of the trash. We provide the disposal. And that's the service that we provide to all the cities. We represent 78 out of the 88 cities in Los Angeles County. One of the advantages of having a facility like this one is we're able to take the trash and, and we're able to sort out all the recyclables. And by sorting out the recyclables, then we have some a pure product that the markets would want to buy. So when we, so that's what the machines here do, and the workers were sorting out the different materials, white paper, cardboard, plastic, whatever the market bears. So if the market wanted to have pure blue paper, we'll be able to do that in a facility like this, as opposed to the landfill, at the landfill, everything just goes in one pile. Compressed natural gas, or CNG, is the, is the gas where they, they're able to get the methane gas from the landfill and put it in a process to compress it and it's used to fuel our vehicles. All of our small carpool vans here at work our small vehicles like water trucks at the landfill are all fueled on compressed landfill gas. So in essence, we generate our own fuel up there. Because we still had too much gas for these other two systems, we put in three internal combustion engines hooked to generators. We run two at all times, and that generates an additional six to seven megawatts of electricity. That then is sent over to this main office and our sewage treatment plant behind us, and is used for the power for these two facilities. We're actually the 20th largest power generator in the state of California. Between generating power at our sewage treatment plants and at our landfill and solid waste facilities, we generate, uh, I think it's 113 megawatts of electricity. So what's happening here is basically a steam engine where we, where we bring water from our recycling, our, water, our wastewater recycling treatment plant. We bring the water and we put it over a stove in a way and we heat the water up to create steam and the steam turns an engine turbine to make 50 megawatts of energy. Now the gas that we use is the landfill gas. That's the methane gas. And what we, use, we have these green pipes located throughout the landfill with vacuums. We're sucking all this methane gas and we're bringing it to this location and that's where we burn it and that's where we're boiling the water. And what you see here are, is the, the cooling towers of where we cool the water back down and we're able to recycle that again. We make everything look so easy. And really, if people recycled more and, and didn't make the trash to begin with, we wouldn't have to build so many structures like this. We wouldn't need as many MRFs. But right now, while we do have trash, while man, while as a society, as we're still producing trash, agencies like ours will manage it. But we could only build so many structures. We could only build so many MRFs like this and they're very costly. So if people recycled and, and reduced the amount of trash and reused more trash, they would be better off as a society.